What's up guys, Shawnee Dogs here, and I am very excited. Unfortunately, that excitement has nothing to do with Call of Duty Infinite Warfare as of now. The contracts kind of suck, they're a little bit better than the last two or three weeks, just because one of them gives us keys, but still not great, and we don't have new weapons. Now, I can't say I'm surprised because I mentioned that tweet a few videos ago. They said they're working on a massive title update and it'll take one to two weeks. And today, they usually update Call of Duty on Tuesdays. It was roughly one week from that point, so there was the possibility, but they said one to two weeks, and this is a developer talking, so when they tell you a time frame, it's usually going to come towards the end of that. So I am really, really hoping that we see the new weapons next week. That is our best bet. If not, we're going to have to wait a very long time, and I'm going to be very disappointed. But the reason that I'm excited is the same reason why you have not seen that intro that you normally do in my videos. I'm currently working on something. I can't say too much about it, but I will make an announcement. I'll put it on Twitter. It is definitely a really awesome milestone. And judging by how things are going, you may actually be able to see it in my next video tomorrow. But for all you guys out there that are disheartened, you're really sad that we didn't get to see the new weapons this week. Maybe you're, you're losing faith in Infinity Ward. You don't really want to play this game anymore. Anymore. Sure, it might be a little stale for this week, but I told you guys in a video a very long time ago, almost a month now already, that our best bet is for the new weapons to come out two weeks exactly from the time of E3, so we still got another week for that. After then, you can throw your Infinite Warfare in the trash because it means I've lost all hope as well and there's nothing we can do. And one last thing I wanted to tell you guys is right now, if you have not seen it already, you have to, have to watch the video that I posted on Father's Day, Double Nuke for Black Sky against a 30th Prestige. It is probably my best gameplay on all of Infinite Warfare. It's very high up there. And because I posted it on Father's Day, it didn't get a lot of views. It's typical for that to happen on certain holidays. So I wasn't too alarmed that not a lot of people were watching it, but you seriously have to check it out. It will be the first link down in the description. And finally, as I get mowed down here and my streak comes to an end, this was the match that I actually completed that contract. So I'll show you the garbage reward that I got for my Phantom Rig. Nothing too special. I wouldn't suggest going out of your way for this thing. And to make up for this whole next week that's going to be a little meh without the new weapons or some cool contracts to do, I have an extremely solid Livecom nuke that I was able to get for one of my subs. And the big change is happening where I will no longer be using Synaptic and very rarely the K-Bar. I was only using it in this gameplay because this particular subscriber didn't have the advanced UAV unlocked. So that made things a lot harder. And there I will use Synaptic and the K-Bar just because I don't have streaks to work towards. But besides that, that is it. You'll be seeing loads of gameplays with new rigs, and I hope you guys do enjoy. I am in a very good mood today. So good, in fact, that we're going to be rocking the pink K-Bar right now. No regrets. We even got a green cactus in here, and we're pushing up mid. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, ooh. First pick. Hmm. You know... I probably shouldn't have run out there like an idiot. Take two. What oh, I hear him. Easy money. Yeah, that, that teammate didn't have dead silence. I didn't want to roll with him. Wow. We got a janitor sweeping the floors. I mean, oh, and there's this Barton in crime. Crouching in a corner. Damn, there's, there's a lot of people in this lobby without dead silence. Jesus. We got a guy in here. Another one, another one. Yeah, we'll we'll take the flank for now. I was not feeling it. Okay, they're pushing the other way. Yeah, they definitely all spawned back there. We gotta wait them out. Oh, oh, there's three of them. Wait, oh, there's two more. Too easy. Oh no. Where you at? Yeah. Oh, that guy's clueless. Oh, yeah, and I forgot to mention. We don't have an advanced UAV. Ooh, so. That's the only reason I'm running synaptic propulsion right now. I've been mixing it up a lot lately. You're going to see that in the next coming videos. I only use this combo if I have to. Like, advanced UAV, that is top priority. If I don't have that, I'm gonna be rocking my propulsion.
too easy. Yeah, the main reason, I mean, you, you start building on a streak. Like right now I'm on a 15 and like there's, I would already have an advance by now. I'd be able to milk him pretty good, but oh my God. Wow, wow, that guy had an M1. Okay, as I was saying, I would be able to milk him right now, but when I, oh my God, what is this? Really? All right, we gotta regroup. You just gotta shake that one off. Okay, so for the third time, oh my God. As I was saying, you got nothing to work towards. I just, I'm running the advanced, I mean the, wow. Running the regular UAV and the counter. Oh. Because, wow. Wow. There's not really a third dominant streak that's good for getting nukes. Sure, you could put on a warden or something and get kills, but that's not gonna really benefit you too much terms of building up streaks I, oh my god I hope that kid's not AFK I hope he was playing he could play like that all day we're actually building up surprisingly fast right now was not expecting this oh that was him again so he is playing I don't know what he's doing might be bad. Oh, ho, ho. that guy had uh, the claw out. All right, it looks like they completely flip. Besides this one guy. Okay, we're only on a ten kill streak. Just gotta keep it moving. Oh, mm, our whole team. New route. And they. Probably did not move. Oh, they're flanking. So we're going to take the ultimate flank. Let me get him. Yes. <laughs> he, oh, he pulled out his... Um, easy money. Right here, right here. That guy pulled out his steel dragon for nothing. What do we got? <clears throat> we're getting closed in on. Okay. All right. Gotta keep it cool. Gotta keep in mind that I, I, not, I don't have streaks to work on. It's all gonna be gun skill. I don't really want to push in too hard because I see them grouping up quite a bit. Oh, this should be an easy kill if he peeks. Hmm. Those are some fresh spawns right there. I think that guy has a shotgun, and I'm getting shot in the back by an M1. Jeez. I'm just concerned the M1 and the shoddy. There's the shoddy. And the okay. Yeah, those are... Those are insta-kills right there. I don't want any part of that. Are we still two off or one? I don't know if it's still tracking. Mm. Okay, we need one more. One more. Ugh. Yo! It's lit, boys. Oh, we didn't manage to get the jug or the, uh, the unstoppables, but you gotta be happy with a game like that. There's only six kills left in the game. We'll take it, baby. A few of these guys were clueless, but they put up a fight. They killed me off my streak. We composed ourselves, and we got back on it. That's what it's about. It's too easy. 48 and 4. Come on. <clears throat> I only had... I had two teammates go positive for a total of plus 2. That is some good work, Sean. I commend you on your work. But that is going to wrap it up for this one. If you did enjoy the video... Please be sure to drop a like.
comment down below with any thoughts or concerns, questions you may have. Tell me about your recent chlamydia experience. And as always, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Some more great videos, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.